I don't know how to introduce this game. Um, so I'm just going <laughs> to Baylor, Colorado. What a boy. Th- oh, Cascading. I, I don't know which fan base has it worse. The, the team that we just talked about in TCU, the one that we're about to talk about in Baylor, or the one that we're about to talk about with, with Kansas State. I mean, what a, what an all-time just sickening moment if, if you're a Baylor fan. This would be a pretty big win for them on the road. You know, Randy, you, you've, seen, you've seen the improvement through through non-con. You have a tough loss against, you know, out of conference for Utah. And then you go up to Folsom and, and you give it to them pretty good. They That defense looks really good. They oh, had a lot. They man. put together a lot of good drives on, on offense. And looks like, boy, you, two seconds on the clock, you're up a touchdown and you find a way to lose that game is, is very, it's got to be gut-wrenching. I thought Dave Barnetta had a great game plan. I oh, really did, good. Brandon. Um, that defense had eight sacks. Eight. Colorado got pulverized on that offensive line. I mean, they, and as mad as I am at Shadur Sanders still in the offseason, ripping them and kind of like ripping his offensive line, like, they're not good. He, had a point. he was um, right. I, maybe, maybe he had a point. Uh, but then again, that's kind of on your dad. Also, to maybe, you know, go get guys. Okay. All right. All right. Yeah, those bullets fly by. Uh, anyway, or tomatoes. Tomatoes were a family from the show. Um, <laughs> you know, but it's interesting, like how everything plays out, though, Brandon, because they had Colorado, and I just don't even know if Colorado's good. <laughs> I mean, that was a they should have lost, but my goodness, how they entertain you week in and week out. Like if you're looking for entertainment. In interest, they just keep producing. I don't know what it is about them, but it's impossible. Even if they don't look great, it's impossible not to watch. And people are mad they stormed the field. You know what? Forget it. I don't have a yeah. problem with it. That was such a bizarre win. And that is a program that's not a his- well, in the 90s, I know they're great. I know in the 80s, 90s, early 2000s, they're a good program. But they've been very bad for 20 plus years. They are in the right. I had no problem with it. And I don't know how they do it. Sanders, that was an all-time moment, though. And then for Hunter to get that play at the end, to force that fumble, go out, which I don't know why Baylor players are like touchdown, which that was the funniest part of that clip to me. But whatever. They had me fooled. Maybe know the rules. They had me fooled. Uh, you that like, 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 that's touchdown. Like, that's why? touchdown. Why? Oh, are they, like, I was, I, that was the funniest part of that clip, but – what a win, Brandon. I mean, and you, you're stunned too. We're both stunned. Yeah, it's it, it's crazy. And when we did our pick on last week, we, we kind of had this, we kind of thought this was coming. It was like, I think Baylor's going to be better defensively. I think Colorado's offensive line is still among the worst I've ever seen. And But I have this feeling that Colorado's going to find a way to win, and they do. And they that's exactly what they did. Travis Hunter had a Heisman moment. Uh, unbelievable. I, he's, I, I, as a, f- a fan of a team that has had to play on Travis Hunter twice, I'm very happy that we don't have to think about that ever again. So I'm, I'm huge, hugely thankful for that. Um, storming the field. So for, I'm always pro storming the field. But I, I think specifically in, in under two circumstances, of course, you get the big upset, the big program changing win. Or like if the win rocks if there's a huge climate climax if there's a huge walk-off win i mean i'm i'm, I'm thinking that they got some flack last year for that colorado state double overtime game i'm sorry yeah you probably don't want to storm the field against the mountain west team that game rocked that ending rocked if i'm standing there in in the student section at midnight after i haven't seen that game i'm losing my mind same thing with that game i see a hail mary i see travis hunter i mean knock the the, the, the ball out i the, i'm storming the field i'm sorry that's that, that's a no-brainer to me. Uh, although, if you see me on Twitter, I probably will point out the fact that, <laughs> yeah, it stormed the field against a Baylor team. Whatever. Get some standards. But, well, yeah, first they off, found a way to win. Before we, before we get back to more of a 12, I, we just want to congratulate Brandon Shanahan on uh, surviving his little uh, jail sentence in Twitter, X, yeah. whatever that's called. Brandon <laughs> Shanahan, he's a survivor this weekend, ladies and gentlemen. I am so proud of Brandon Shanahan. Um, I so I make jokes about being chronically online, especially like college football related. I'm surprised with how much of a hard time I had not being able to tweet. So I I, I woke up this morning, checked, I was like, all right, the restrictions been lifted. 
By the way, that was the silliest restriction I, I, I've ever seen. Um, it, it's very funny, and like I'm, I'm glad I didn't like get in any real trouble or lose access to my account. But uh, very, very, very silly stuff. Uh, but yeah, it was a, it was an anticlimactic Saturday. I had to, you know, talk with the, the, the family. I was like, all right, well, I guess I can't just be on Twitter the whole day. This doesn't do anybody any good, but especially with the, 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 the college football games going on. I mean, what a, what a bad day to be, to, to be suspended from Twitter. Oh, a terrible day, but it's, it, but it makes the story even funnier though. I mean, yeah. just, you know, Big J journal didn't, journalist didn't like what you had to say. That's, that's just part of life, Brandon. That's just part of your, uh, that's just part of your aura, your, so. your mystique. I mean, seriously. Yeah, I, I I don't know. I just I, thought it was very funny. I, I you said to me that I lost. I really I burst <laughs> it out. That. I did. Yeah, I mean, it was it was a very good bit. I'm happy to be back on the on the bird app. We're back. Colorado gets the win, unfortunately. 